Hello everyone and welcome to the Stephanie Stevens Show from a Queen's point of view. Tonight I am on talking about the second part of my show in Canada, what we got to do with it. As you guys know, marijuana became legal in Canada, so they smoking everywhere, child. Mm -hmm. Look at me, I even got me one. Mm -hmm. Charlie smoking in Canada. <laughs> yes, lower. Well, I have a few things to tell you guys that when you're smoking, things you should do and you shouldn't do. Okay? Now, hold on a minute. Let me just get one big draw off of this. Mm -hmm. Oh, as a matter of fact, I got to let you guys know. My new What to Eat um, Got to Do With It t-shirts are now on sale on um, Drag Swap or Ultimate Drag Swap. Or just message me and we'll get the information out to you where you can get my Hot Legs t-shirt for my Tina Turner tribute show and my new weed t-shirt, What's Love Got to Do With It. I have three, five different um, t-shirt concepts for you. So if you like fabulous memorabilia from my shows, they will be available for $40. If you order now, you can get them for $20 and $3 shipping and handling for a limited um, time only. Okay, everybody? I will put them all up again when I'm having another sale for the new collection that's going to be coming out in a few weeks. Okay, so thank you guys so much for tuning in to The Stephanie Stevens Show from a Queen's point of view. Like I was saying, excuse me. <sighs> it's raining up a storm in Toronto tonight, so I'm just here in my drag room, chilling, mm -hmm. having me a toke or two, y'all. Just having me a toke. Ooh, when you're smoking, honey, don't you make sure you know they got rules in Canada when you're smoking. You're supposed to be nine feet away from the building. Child, when they said nine feet, I thought they was talking about something else. I ran over there, if y'all know what I mean. <laughs> I ran over there to get me a little something, something. Child, the man told me that they didn't have none of those over there. I was like, oh, Lord. Little Asian man telling me they ain't got nine over here. I was like, oh, Lord. Mm, I just smoke my joint and pretend like everybody else. <laughs> It ain't, it ain't the little Chinese man's fault that he can't handle a sister. <laughs> Somebody's fault. I don't know who it is. Let me have a couple more talks to this and I'll tell y'all the real truth. Because mm, we know nothing grows in the shade. Okay, y'all. Now, I have been known to smoke too many, um, too much weed and wake up in strangers' apartments. Mm hmm you thought they were cute. <laughs> you wake up. You look over there. You go, what? <laughs> Y'all know what I'm thinking. What the fuck? Or was I smoking? Mm -hmm. I have woken up with some. Trust me, I'm telling you right now. I got so high one time, child. I woke up with somebody that looked like um, Wesley Snipes. I said, damn. Mm, 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 mm. I'm gonna have to sneak this motherfucker over the balcony. Low. Ooh, low. Because you know the little old lady that lived next door to me, she see everything. And I'm sure she gonna be like, who that ugly motherfucker you had over there last night? I'll be like, I don't know who that motherfucker was. I was high. <laughs> Can you imagine smoking weed? And waking up with some ugly motherfuckers. Have you ever thought about that? You smoke weed and you go home with people you would never go home with if you weren't smoking weed. So be careful, ladies, when you're smoking weed. You don't want to go home with ugly and crazy motherfuckers. Yeah, he look okay after about the third and fourth gin and juice. But yeah, his breath still stinks. And he's got his friend's clothes on. 
to try to make it work. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Y'all know better. Mm -hmm. But we've all been known to grab a piece of trade at the um, at last call. We could care less what it looked like. We'd be out by the hot dog stand. He can went from looking a mess to like, damn, he fine. You know damn well he ain't fine. But yet y'all run over there anyway. Mm, be in the backseat of cars. I seen you. And the um, parking lot over there across the street from the club. Mm, steamy windows. Mm, you hoes and something else. Ooh, two o'clock. Come, honey, y'all run. <laughs> I run over there and try to get y'all a man quick. Because you know how it is, honey. It's hard cruising around um, in a cab in a concerning neighborhood trying to get your weed smoke on and a man. Mm, this is Toronto. Look out. But anyway. <laughs> oh, they have so many rules in Canada about smoking weed. I want to let y'all know just a few of them. You got to be, don't don't smoke weed near the children's playground, which I agree with. Don't smoke no weed near the children's playground. Don't get in your car while high. Don't be trying to drive you and your friends to the club when you all fucked up. Because you know y'all ain't going to make it there, okay? First of all, you got to stop off at the grocery store and get y'all some bologna and stuff like that. Because, oh, Lord, bologna is the I don't even like bologna. But bologna tastes good. After you done um, smoked a few joints, you'd be like, damn, this is these are cold cuts and something else. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, Lord, get you a bologna sandwich, put you some mayonnaise on it, Lord. Mm -hmm. And they ain't even no Hellman's, honey. You get you some of that no-name brand mayonnaise from Food Basic, honey, or Metro. Mm -hmm. I've been known to eat a bologna sandwich at around 2, 3, 4, 5 o'clock in the morning after your tail the left. Mm -hmm. Or you trying to get rid of it. Mm -hmm. Be careful, honey, because you got some good weed joke. That man ain't never leaving. And ain't nothing worse than a man in your apartment that can't fuck, got a small dick, bad breath, and won't leave your apartment. Ooh, ain't nothing worse than that. You hear me, Marquita? <laughs> girl, you know we know, girl. Okay. Mm -hmm. Child. Mm -hmm. Excuse me one minute, child. Mm. Oh Lord. Mm, mm, mm. That just took all of the energy out of me, y'all. You know what? Mm. And you know, it's a shame. I, I don't do hookups anymore because I'm all about business now. So I just want to travel and make money, paper my house, and call it a day. But, um,. I have been thinking about, you remember those good old days? Craigslist was good. Craigslist was good for that, for a quick hookup, honey, a cute piece of trade. It's Friday, Saturday night, honey. You can get a piece of trade real quick on back page, you know, just in case your light bill was due, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Y'all yeah, know what I mean. Get your smoke on. Ooh. Never sit around and smoke weed with your girlfriends, though. Because in the conversation, it'll come out. They done had your man. Ooh, and the fight break out. Ah! <laughs> and let it slip. I slept with Jerome. Oh, Lord. Friendship over. <laughs> so don't smoke weed with your friends. Mm -mm. They tells the truth. Okay. Oh, mm. <sighs> how many of y'all out there done smoked weed and woke up in strangers' apartments? Mm. Oh, damn. How the hell I got over here? Mm, mm, mm. And ain't nothing worse than smoking weed with somebody and going to their place 
and they got 14 roommates. How do you fuck 14 roommates? Oh, Lord. Hold on a minute. Child, this is some good shit. I don't know what it is. I think it's duct tape rolled up into a joint. <laughs> Cause y'all know I don't do drugs or smoke weed or nothing like that. But I do simulate it. Cause it's good for my show and my my morale. When it comes to me doing my show, I have to get into the um groove of um of of what my show is going to happen. I can't just walk out there on the stage dry. It doesn't doesn't work for me like that. I have to I have to sort of sit around and talk about it and actually act like I'm in the situation to go out on the stage and really kill it. If y'all know what I mean. Mm -hmm. Excuse me. Y'all let me know what y'all smoke. What y'all be smoking out there? Do y'all smoke? What y'all smoke? Okay. Over and out, everybody. It's Stephanie Stevens from a Queen's Point of View. Please be sure to check me out on YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. Be sure to share my videos, my pictures, and comments with everyone. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to From a Queen's Point of View. I'm Stephanie Stevens. And if you'd like to book me for any occasion, please contact my agent here in Toronto, Mr. Nick Folks from Complex 5 Entertainment, 416-724-7510, or internationally or the USA, Mr. Stephen Ford at 323-864-1933, divasanddjs.com. Thanks, everybody. Have a blessed week. Now, get y'all smoke on. Get your smoke on. And don't forget, I have my new t-shirts on sale, small, medium, and large, $40. If you order one right now, they're $20, $3 shipping and handling, $23 total. I'll send one right out to you. They only come in black for the moment. There'll be a collection of five. So it'll be great memorabilia for you down the road, okay? So make sure you guys get some of um, order my t-shirts. They're on Drag Swap or Ultimate Drag Shop or just Facebook me. Thanks, everybody, from a Queen's point of view. I'm Stephanie Stevens. Good night, everybody. Oh, Lord, that's good. That feels good. Good night, everybody.